Now children, here is an interesting topic for you. Animals. You love animals? Yes. And you love to know where they live. Yes. So we are going to look at today animal homes. Each animal. Where do they live? Alright. Look at the beautiful picture we have here. Lovely, isn't it? Let's look at each animal and the home where they live. And if they, each animal's home has a name. That's what we are going to look at today. Yes, it's very interesting for you. Beautiful pictures. Look at it and let's enjoy. Good. Here we are, our first animal home. Shall we look at? Look. What do we see here? There's a tiny hill. And what do you see over here? Ants. Ants going in and out. So we're going to look at what is the home of an ant? What do you call the home of an ant? Spell this. A-N-T. And what do the ant do to you? They bite you. So this is the home built by the ant. What is the name of the house of the ant? It's a tiny hill. So what will you call it? Ant plus hill and hill. Ant makes a hill. How? They go in, dig out all the sand and put it out. It becomes a tiny hill. Ant lives in an ant Hill. Spell ant hill. A N T H I L L. Ants. Where do they live? In an ant hill. Did you enjoy? Isn't it a beautiful picture? I'm sure you will never forget. Ants live in an ant hill. Home of an ant is called an ant hill. Good. Good. Let's look at another animal and its home. Look. What do you see here? A huge rock and somebody sitting inside. Lion! Good! Where does the lion live? What is the name of his home? The lion lives in a... This is called a... Den. Spell den. D. E. N. Then, it's a huge rock and a hole inside. And the lion lives in the den. Home of a lion is called den. Where did the lion live? In a den. Good. Let's look at another animal and find its home. Look. Who is this? Pig. Pig. What is the home of a pig called? Sty. Very good. This is a pig sty. Spell sty. S T Y sty. The pig. They live in a home called sty. Pigs are put in the sty. Pig sty. What is the home of a pig? Sty. Good. Let's look at another animal. Look what we have here. Sheep. Sheep. What do they give us? Wool. Look at that body full of wool. Sheep. Where do the sheep live? What is the home of a sheep called? Sheep live in a Pen. All the sheep are put into an enclosure and you call that a pen. P-E-N, pen. The home of a sheep. Home of sheep is called pen. Let's look at another animal and find its home. Look. Here we have a rabbit. 
How do you know it's a rabbit? He has long ears. What is the home of a rabbit called? He makes his own burrow. Yes, here. He made a large hole and he goes in. The home of a rabbit is called a burrow. B U R R O W. Burrow. A rabbit makes its own burrow, its own home. A rabbit lives in a burrow. Kurt. Let's look at another animal. Look what we have here. Look. We have, can you see here? Hen. Hen. The home of a hen. Where did the hen live? Hen is put it into a coop. Hen lives in a coop. C-O-O-P. Coop. What is the hen house called? Coop. Hen house is called coop. Let's look at another animal. Look what we have here. Here you have a honey bee. Bee. What do the bee do? They collect honey for us. And their house is called bees. Build their own house and it's called a honeycomb. That's called a hive. This is called honeycomb. And their home is called hive. Bee hive. They collect and put it into their house. And we collect honey from there. Bees live in a bee hive. Spell hive. H-I-V-E. Hive. Bees live in a bee hive. Good. Let's look at another animal and its home. Look what we have here. Here you have a tiny rat. Where does the rat live? They make their own hole and live, make, and live in it. Rats live in a hole. Yes? Good. Spell hole. H-O-L-E. Hole. They nibble and make a hole and they live in it. Any dark, damp places. Rats live in a hole. See how cute he looks? He made a large hole and he's sitting in it. Rats live in a rat hole. Let's look at another animal. Kurt, here we are. Look at your little puppy. The dog. Always we make a home for them. Yes, the dog. The dog's house is called a kennel. You make a kennel for him to sit in, to live in. Dogs live in a kennel. Spell kennel K-E-N-N-E-L. Kennel. Dog's house is called a kennel. Good. Let's look at another animal and its home. Look, who is this? Huge, big elephant. Where does the elephant live? What is his home called? Forest. Jungle forest is the place we find this huge animal. Elephant lives in the forest. F-O-R-E-S-T, forest. Elephant lives in the forest, huge forest full of trees and is very happy there. Let's look at another animal and its home. Look. With this little birdie. Bird. Bird makes its own home on the top of tall trees where you cannot touch. Between branches, he makes a lovely little home. And the bird's home is called a nest. Spell nest, N-E-S-T, nest. Birds build their own nest and they live in it. They lay egg and take care of the little ones. Birds live in its own 
nest. Let's look at another animal and its home. Look. With this, a horse. You like to take a ride on a horse. Yes. Now, what is the home of a horse? Horses are put into a house, and their home is called a stable. Their home is called a stable. Who spells stable? S T A B L E. Stable. Home of a horse is called a stable. They are put into a stable. All the horses are put into a stable. Yes. Good. Let's go on to look at another animal. Look what we have here. Who is this? He's got something in his hand to eat. Monkey eating a banana. Yes. Monkey eating a banana. What is the home of a monkey? Where does he live? He lives in the tree. He swings from tree to tree, and he's very happy there. His home is a tree. T R E E tree. He puts his tail on the branch and swings from one branch to another. Monkey lives in a tree. Its home is a tree. Huge, tall trees. Good. Let's go on to look at another animal and its home. Look what we have here. Who is this? Cow. What does she give us? She gives us milk. You like to drink some milk? Cow gives us milk. You make a home for the cow. What is the home of a cow? The cows are put into a shed. Home of a cow is shed. Spell shed. S H E D shed. This is a cow shed. Home of a cow is called shed. Cow shed. Good. Let's go on to look at another animal in its home. Look. You might find this in your home. You look at the corners of your house. And you might find a lovely pattern like this, and a little spider sitting in between, waiting to get someone to fall onto the house so that he can eat. Spider. Spiders make their own house. They weave their own house. Spiders' house is called a web. Look at the lovely pattern he has made. W E B web. A home of a spider is called a web. It is sticky, and if any insect pass by, they get caught, and the spider eat that little insect. Good. Let's look at another animal and its home. Here is a pond, and you have duck and ducklings. A duck and duckling. Their home is called pond. A duck lives in a pond. They're very happy with the duck and the mama duck and the baby. They all live in a pond. They go swimming round and round. Spell pond. P O N D. Pond. Pond is a small place with water, with land around. A tiny place. There's enough water for the duck and the baby ducklings to swim about. Duck lives in a pond.